Human population is increasing rapidly, and with this increase comes a demand for space. Like other places around the world, Africa is a human-dominated landscape with very limited space available for their wildlife. This limitation in space can cause an increase in human-wildlife conflict from destroying crops and fences to more serious conflicts with predators. One of these top predators is the spotted hyena. One of the most underrated predators in Africa is better known as the African lion's enemy thanks to the propaganda of Disney's well-known film, The Lion King. Portrayed as cowardly scavengers and seen as villains in most African cultures, spotted hyenas are viewed as nuisances and are oftentimes overlooked when compared to other more charismatic megafauna. Unlike most mammalian communities, hyenas have a matriarchal system. This means the females are dominant in their social organization, also known as a clan. The hyenas are ranked in their clan, and even the lowest ranked female is dominant over the highest ranked male. What makes hyenas so extraordinary is their tremendous strength. Hyenas have a powerful jaw capable of crushing a human skull. Contrary to popular belief, spotted hyenas are not hermaphrodites. This was thought to be true because the females have pseudopenises. That's right, pseudopenises. Female hyenas have a fused clitoris that resembles a male penis. This trait makes it very difficult to distinguish male from female by just looking at a hyena. Due to this crazy biology, hyenas are only able to have one or two pups a litter, and sometimes three, although that is extremely rare. Spotted hyenas are amazing creatures. The negative perception of hyenas as villains is a downfall to the species, which needs protection because of the limited space that is available to them. This is where my research comes in. My research focuses on the distribution and abundance of spotted hyenas in the Northern Thule Game Reserve. As part of an ongoing project on lions within the reserve, the first hyena calling station was done in 2008. The purpose of this project is to determine if the growing population of lions within this reserve has an effect on the spotted hyena populations. Calling stations were conducted in 2008, 2009, 2015, and another study is proposed to be done in 2016. Spotted hyenas are one of the most successful large predators in Africa. Having such a widely ranging diet and a high tolerance against diseases, it comes to no surprise why hyenas have been so successful in this fragmented landscape. Since hyenas are currently categorized as a least concern by the IUCN Red List of Threatened Species, they are oftentimes overlooked when it comes to conservation. But what a lot of people don't realize is that our ecosystem is interconnected, and in order to determine how to slow the decline of other top predators in Africa, we need to understand every piece of the puzzle. We hope to use this information as a building block for future hyena research within this reserve and gain a better understanding of the complex dynamic that is the African savanna.